Hi, thanks for joining me for today's episode of the Lockdown Lectionary. Well, the psalm assigned for this week by the lectionary is Psalm 70. And it's just a few short verses long, but in those few short verses, it provides an interesting jumping off point for a variety of conversations that we can have. And so this week, we're going to be looking at three aspects of Psalm 70 for our times of devotion. So listen now to the words of Psalm 70. Be pleased, O God, to deliver me. O Lord, make haste to help me. Let those be put to shame and confusion who seek my life. Let those be turned back and brought to dishonor who desire to hurt me. Let those who say, aha, aha, turn back because of their shame. Let all who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. Let those who love your salvation say evermore, God is great. But I am poor and needy. Hasten to me, O God. You are my help and my deliverer. O Lord, do not delay. Well, the first glimpse of Psalm 70 this week has to do with the value of lament. You can hear the cries of the psalmist as he pleads with God throughout these verses. When we put ourselves into the psalm, we probably think about the ways that we're often afraid or ashamed to express grief and anger in public, or maybe even afraid and ashamed to do it to close friends and family members. As a society, those sorts of expressions make us uncomfortable and are often taken as signs of weakness or suggest that someone who mourns in that way is unbalanced or ill. But lament is an important part of our lives. We can't get by without grieving all sorts of things that happen to us. And it doesn't have to be something earth-shattering like the death of a loved one, either. There are all sorts of losses that we grieve all the time, especially now in the midst of this pandemic. We mourn the loss of our sense of freedom, the loss of connection with others, the loss of routine and order, and so many more things. We need to grieve those losses, because if we hold that grief inside, it will do nothing for us except to cause us even more pain. And so remember that lament is an important part of our lives of faith. Our prayer life is a good space in which to process that grief. Feel free to cry out to God with your pain, just like the psalmist does. God is certainly big enough to, t to handle it. Let's pray. God, when there is nowhere else we can turn, we cry out to you. Hear our cries and comfort our hearts. Amen. Well, thanks for joining me today for the Walkdown Lectionary. Be sure to check out the comments below for today's musical selection. Be safe, stay at home, and wash your... wear your masks. I almost said the old one. Peace be with you.